Hey everybody, welcome back to RKG. It's just M with no T. Hold the T, please. We are in the ceremony of um, a sacrifice. I don't know, but these guys are all in my way. I can't even. I can't. They're impenetrable. I don't really want to try talking to them, but maybe I have to. Let's see here. There's no response. Oh, dang it, this is significantly less exciting than uh, I thought it would be. <laughs> they just walled me off, and I don't think I can force my way past them. There's no there's no gap in their formation. They, they're they perfectly unified. Can't even get to that item over there. Maybe if I talk to this guy, he'll move. Oh, 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 oh. wow, that was fortunate. Blue, blue, oh, you'd like to be one of us. Then give up what you're doing and go meet the great Mr. Carpenter as soon as possible. Do -do. I bet you this is blue clothes. Open the present. Oh, oh. That was not what I anticipated. Uh, okay, I will go meet Mr. Carpenter. Hmm, I bet you I have to talk to the right, right person every time. Maybe I don't. Huh, I wonder how this works. Maybe I talk to this person? This person? This person? I wonder if I just... Hmm. Will that be... Maybe I talk to him again? No? And, ah, blue blue. Don't bother us. We're in the middle of prayer. Okay, I'll move out of your way. Go quickly. So I just have to find the right guys to talk to to get moved out of my way. Like, maybe... I don't really notice a difference in their blue blue... I'll stand somewhere else. Mm. No response. Blue, blue. Lagoon, blue, blue. Wait, but nothing? Blue, blue, lagoon, blue, blue. Huh. Let's see. No response. Hmm. Herm. Rockin' it. Let's see. We got this far. I ask people to move. It's not this guy. We already tried. Lagoon blue guy. Blue lagoon guy. Blue lagoon, yep, yep, we got it. These are all people that are ah, too deep. Blue blue, don't disrupt our meeting. I'll stomp on you. Oh, now they're getting aggressive. This seems like a bad spot to engage with some insane cultists, considering I'm surrounded by insane cultists locked in prayer, but... Is it all good fuck? Nah, I bet you this guy just moves after he sees what I did to his friend. Oh, dang it, right. Ah! What? Hmm. So, only some of these guys are not transfixed enough in prayer. The rest of these guys are so balls deep into their prayer that they didn't even acknowledge my existence. Blue, blue. What? Are you saying that I'm only capable of walking in place? That's not true, see? Oh, this is... I thought that leading up to it, it was only going to be obvious, like, oh, I need to move here, I should talk to this guy. But apparently they've got a whole... <gasps> green, green. Oh, that's not... I'm still new at this. <laughs> that's fun. Okay, I don't want to talk to it. You're right. Open the present. There's a skip sandwich. How about that? Um, how am I doing goods-wise, inventory-wise? Good on that stuff. I don't need to use any items, really, to... Okay, none of these guys can really move out. I'd have to fight. Blue, blue. Hey, you, anti-blue boy. You're getting on my nerves. See, I figured I'd have to fight this guy, because there was no real other spots for people to kind of jam into and move around. Alright, and this one? Nope, this one. Oh, um, this one? Well, what was the point of talking to him then? Of fighting him? Alright, well, let's go down here and see if we can people to... <laughs> blue blue. <laughs> Trying to learn how to whistle. I heard that whistling makes one smile. I'll practice over there. That's good. Blue blue. 
You strange, unmasked fellow. Don't go to heaven. Wow. That's aggressive. Jesus. He is what I would call a fanatic. I don't know about you guys, but I'm super happy that um, I spent some time grinding. Because life is like easy street now. Blue, blue. This should wake you up. Ah! I wonder if all these guys moving around are going to fight me. See, I don't really care to take them out. Because I know that they're just, they're just innocent folks who've had um, their minds probed and their inner thoughts... Oh, Psy Carmel, nice. If those are going to be dropped more frequently, that is okie doke by me. Um, but they've had their thoughts corrupted and stuff, and... Let's talk to these guys closer to the top brass. Hmm, okay. Nobody else is walking around freely. Okay, I think we... I think we talked all their ears off. We got all the... Oh, blue, blue. Those weren't believers. Must not be good to eternity with you. Painter. I am gonna heal. Oh, where are they all going? Blue, blue. You can't be happy unless you know happy. Happy is. Oh, what? Where are they going? What are they doing? I'm curious now. Are they just gonna take a lap? Maybe that's part of the ritual. I'm gonna talk to these guys until they figure their shit out. Oh, they're not going to stop? I'll stop them. Your outfit. The color is wicked. Huh. So I think there was four of them. I beat one of them. These guys still talk. Why would a person who's not blue be here? Because I need to talk to Dr. Car Mr. Carpenter because the dude's fucking... child kidnapping asshole. Oh yeah, we were going to use goods. We were going to use... Uh, we don't need a crisp skip sandwich, but we can croissant it up. Alright. You're probably not Mr. Carpenter, but... I, I screamed! Because I didn't know what else to do. And you did it again. Very well. Excellent script writing. What is that golden evil statue? Thanks for coming. I've been waiting for you. I need your assistance to help make the world blue and change it to a happy, peaceful society. Will you be my right-hand assistant? No! If you don't want to be my right hand, my left hand would be just fine. Just kidding. Your existence is a problem for me and my religion. Defy me and I'll end your pitiful game. Carpenter's lightning was reflected by the Franklin badge. Yes! I'm curious now what would have happened had I not had the Franklin badge. Uh, super glad that I took a trip to that backwoods shed and she gave me that. Didn't hit anyone. Didn't hit anyone. Nice. Oh yeah, the funky uh, circular waving background here, all blue. So I bet you he starts off the the collect of the line. Yeah, this is awesome. Super happy that um, Nancy gave me the. Oh shit! Easy peasy, squeezy lemons. Now level 24. Oh, baby. Offense up by 3. Up by 30. Up by 5. Realize the power of healing beta. Cha-chang. Alright, let's go save Nancy. Did you see the Manny Manny statue behind me? Since I got the statue, I've been doing particular things. Please forgive me if you can. I just wanted to have a normal life. Bullshit! I apologize to everyone. Here's the key to open the jail on the mountain where Nancy is being held. Take the key and go. You don't get off that easy, asshole. Let me see that goddamn statue. 
please forgive me if you can. I just want to have blah 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 blah. So, uh, obviously that statue is full of evil and gives you the power to control lightning. So I bet that um, you would that would have started off with a bang if I hadn't had the Franklin badge. <gasps> Whoa! The religion disband real quick. Look at that. Oh, let's talk to these guys. What are they up to? Sorry about everything. <laughs> let's be buddies. Why? How quickly they're disillusioned from their religion. It looks like almost everyone woke up and left. Drinking the Kool-Aid. There are only three people remaining. I don't want to stay. I'll get out of here. See, they were just doing it because it was popular. Doing it because the Joneses were. Ah, this is much pleasant. Pokey, you son of a bitch. What a horrible nightmare. I somehow woke up. Azo, hey, let's be friends again. Please answer me. I promise to be good, huh? Okay. Mm-hmm. I know, Pokey. It's not your fault. Ha! I lied. See, you sucker. Whoa! You son of a bitch. I was ready to forgive you and everything. Wow. I feel betrayed. I totally thought he was being genuine right there. At least he told me now instead of holding on to that. All right, let's go free Nancy. First things first. Just all by herself. Maybe Pokey's gonna be here. I'll teach him a thing or two. Whoop! Pap and pow. Try to avoid those. Nancy, I come to save you. Uh, do I have to go into my goods and use the key to the cabin? Yep. Azo, use the key to the cabin. Do 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 do. Thank you, Azo. You're just like I imagined you would be, all muscly and brave. I'm sure that some people in Tucson are worried about me. Getting back there may be dangerous, but we can do it if we combine our strength. I'm able to use a little psychic power that's actually pretty deadly. Let's get back to Tucson. Oh, yep, take your teddy bear, for sure. Nancy, join me. Sweet. Whoa, okay, cool. She follows me around, just like the bear did. Uh, status. Ooh, I can left and right now. Nancy level one? Oh, man. Wow. I imagine that they would put her at some sort of a... I like it, though. That's cool. Um, so I play D&D &D, uh, with Travis. And... Oh, I see. If it hit... Oh, so as you gain more party members... Oh, okay, well, let's see what she got. Prey? She's got Prey. What's her sigh? She's got Freeze. Uh, how much does that cost? Four? Nice, it's cheap, which is awesome. And I assume she'll get more side power as we go. Oh, and this is good that they give birds... Aha! Uh -huh. Let's just try Prey. I don't know what it is. I should have... I should have uh, taken a look. Um, prayed with a whole heart. Ah, I got it. It's a healing thing. Perfect. Um, D and D, right? Um, if your character dies in D and D, right, you gotta come back as a new one. And most of the time, you just come back at the same level as you were at when your character died or a level before or whatever. But hmm. is an answer each gain two points. Uh, but sometimes you can elect to go lower level than even that. And I think that's a really good way to, um, one, kind of build your character through the levels and see what's helpful and what you want and what you don't want. And you'll level up way faster because you're fighting stronger things because you're with a stronger party. <sighs> um, but two, there's also the survivability of things. But hey, look at that. All the blue is washed off of everything. Nice. wonder if people are still assholes. Um... I do like the dynamic that they did, putting her at level one and giving her a teddy bear to protect her, and then putting those um, kind of weaker crows out front to farm on if you wanted to. I thought that was a good move. All right, let's see if this lady's still a bitch. Mr. Carpenter was really strange, but so was everyone else. Huh, well, good deal. Let's see if this guy still got some... Oh, hi -o. That's it. Oh, hi all. That's it, okay. Let's see if this guy's still a dick. Pokey was. Even the cow doesn't have blueberry milk anymore. 
You really think I was a bad boy? Uh, yeah. Fucking, you kidnapped Nancy, you dickbag. My wife has run away for a second time. I'm such a lucky man. <laughs> wow, brutal. I apologize. I don't even know what you did, but you should apologize. Awesome. Happy Happy Valley. Saved. Let's head back to Tucson. I woke up from the dream. I forget what was here. Oh, it's still blue in here. What's going on? I too was wrong in many ways. Seems like I'm no longer hypnotized. So I wonder if that statue, that golden statue, was brought by Gygus as a... Like a power siphon, you know? To slowly take over and hypnotize folks. And maybe, uh... Mr. Carpenter was this big douchebag and saw the, the, the power game. Alright, so this is going to be tricky. We don't want Nancy to get hurt. We kick these guys out. Oh, the tree came too. Damn. Well, if Nancy survives, she gets... I want... Yeah. We'll see how things turn out. This should be good. So, we can... I don't really want to, though. We'll just bash things. I think I can bash things in one hit now. Uh, let's just dip in. Oh, I should have bought stuff. Dang it. Maybe I'll double back and do a little bit of shopping. Because I think it has better things here than it does um, in Tucson. But yeah, let's do a little bashing. Let's just Nancy. See how she do. Oh! What? So, wait. Everything's red like I lost, but I didn't, I didn't lose? Huh. Can I good? Can I give her a cookie while she's down? And Nancy ate it, but Nancy was already gone. Oh, so you can waste waste items that way. I mean, that's fine. Now I know. She's got a phoenix down before. I wonder if she'll be put at one um, at the end of the battle. Burst into flames. It, ah. Okay. See, it says this is 150, but here I'm sitting at, like, 30. Mm. Damn it, that 600 health points could have really got. Ah! That's a bummer. Well, maybe we'll go fix that real quick and grind a couple times on uh, on those spiteful crows. But you guys don't have to stick around for that. I will uh, catch y'all on the flip side. Okay. Feeling semi comfortable with where we're at uh, with Nancy. She's level 13. Uh, and in doing so, I bought a couple things for her. Um, her side points are already up to 50. She's pretty much a glass cannon. I mean, look at this stuff. She has a shield spell, no uh, recovery magic to speak of, and holy cow does she have a lot of offense here. And my favorite part is that it gives me a varying degree of like, I can do thunder for three, I can do fire for four, or fire for six, which gets a whole row of enemies. I didn't even only realize rows of enemies were a mechanic in combat, but since trying to use that in combat, and I'll show that you guys that after we get into battle, uh, there are definitely distinct front and back rows, and so she can target entire rows uh, for six uh, side points, and then freeze. Let's see, causes very cold wind to swirl around one enemy, inflicting about 180 points of damage, and it may freeze the enemy completely. It's not so effective against some enemies. Uh, and then the thunder. And then the enemy is thunderstruck for about 120 points. You may miss when there are a few enemies. You may miss when there are a few enemies. That's weird. Uh, eliminates a psychic or psychic power shield. Ah! I did not realize that. Fantastic. And she's already got a beta version of freeze for nine so i've got versions you know different power levels from three four six and nine i've got where i can target rows of enemies uh, i really like the options that i have with her but she only has uh, 60 hit points i don't think her defense is that high another thing that i discovered when i was equipping her with stuff she has her own inventory um 
box, which is fantastic. And I think I'm just going to go ahead and give those to Nancy. Um, I was really getting concerned as the game went on that I was just going to have these, what, 12 slots to put things in the entire game, and I was going to have to figure out how to make do with that. But now I see that as the game goes on, I will get more party members and more inventory space. Uh, I'm also a little bummed that I didn't um, save any of Azo's old equipment, because it appears that uh, that Nancy could use some of it as well. So now I'll either have to rebuy it, yeah, I think I'll just have to rebuy it, or just wait, wait until I get to Threed and see what they have. I did buy Nancy some equipment, at least just to get back, me back to Tucson. And I know there's some people who wanted to see Nancy after we got back there, so I didn't want to get too um, frugal for no reason. I mean, I've got plenty of cash in the bank right now. I don't know if there comes to be a time where there's a big cash siphon. But right now I'm sitting sitting pretty good, so we'll see uh, if we can survive the trek back. Uh, I think this is the long way that I'm going. Ah. Jeez. So maybe I'll be able to show you here. Let's see, fire, front row, back row, front row, back row. You can kind of tell that um, the robot's in front. I think I'm just going to pray. She has this ability called prayer. Um, and I didn't know what to do at first, but uh, you'll see. And she prayed with her whole heart. Some heavy air flowed in the area. Oh, what? Well, that's not normally what it does. Maybe I'll have to read the descriptor of it. But the first time I tried Prey, it, held, it healed for a bit of dazzling light. Huh. Could not stop crying. Oh, now everybody's crying. What? So, I'm definitely going to have to read the descriptor for what's going on with prayer. Maybe it's just like a... Pandora's Pandora's box of stuff here. Maybe Pandora's box isn't quite the uh, the right analogy there. Um, but just a randomized status effect thing, or what? Because it seems to affect everybody. Like everybody got sad, enemies and I did. Um, let's take a look. Let's go to our status here. Uh, Huh, it doesn't let me. It's just for Psy information. I can't really explore what Prayer does. Interesting. So I guess I... Oh, status. We're not crying anymore. I guess I'll just have to keep using it and decide for myself how it affects and how I should use it. Because like I said, I was pretty sure it healed me one time, uh, but it didn't at all that time. So let's get rid of the sprout before it calls more sprouts. Let's do some offense here. Let's get rid of this tree before he causes too much. Too much damage. Because, yeah, Nancy level 1 was not a fantastic, uh, a fantastic ally. She was very much a liability. Oof. It's gonna hit both of us. Nancy's gonna chill at one. So th that is kind of how I anticipated guts working, in that it did uh, enough damage to wipe Nancy out, and she hung on at one. But with Azo, it seems that frequently they'll do enough damage to wipe him out, and he'll hang on at much higher than one. It'll like deal only 30 damage or something. I don't know if that's because his guts are higher, or... I, I don't know. I, I, I don't really know how the mechanics work for it, but... Maybe we'll figure it out. Maybe we won't. Alright, let's try to do it this way this time. Let's try to fire the front... Yeah, the front row. See if, uh... It's, it's super effective or something. Ugh, not enough to kill him. Bummer. That sucks. Good to know that their magnet ability is only for one target, not my whole party. That would suck. Uh, let's 
Higher cost six. We're almost to two cent, I feel. Uh, we'll just bash. Let's just bash him. Let's not get him quite all out yet. This game definitely has me, like, overly concerned about... Ugh, Nancy. Fuck. See, her guts didn't help her out there. And Azo's... Oh, Jesus. Um, I don't know if this is... I don't understand how this is going to work. I'm at zero. Yeah, got hurt and collapsed. Why does it make me go to the next, next frame? Why doesn't it just kill me right off as I'm at zero? And I don't know that the flame from the tree have ever actually, like, killed me. They always do massive amounts of damage. <sighs> blarf. Blarf, blarf, blarf. Well, I guess last episode was our one episode where we, uh, we're, we're death free. Now we're, uh, par for the course here. We've had at least one death. Let's see how we, ah, ugh, ugh. how much cash do we have? 63, not enough to get her healed. All right, well, I'll do some cleaning up here and I'll see you guys where we left off. So we made it to the bridge. We just fought another territorial oak and sprouts. And again, the guy who burst into flame really did a number on Nancy. And my, I don't have enough Psy with... Oh, I guess I have the Psy candy. I could try to... Uh, steal. Give. There. Um, hold on, let's check to see what... Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Status. Do, do, do. Recover. Yep, 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 yep. Uh... Cures poisoning, nausea, feeling strange, uncontrollable crying. In addition, uh, not death. So maybe we'll just hang tight with that. Do I have anything to eat though? Skip sandwich. Uh, it's not great, but it's better than nothing. Covered six. Oh, oh, I guess I have enough for just a quick life up. Oh, no, Territorial Oaks, no! Oh, Nancy's ghost? You kidding me? Man. Brutal. Um, I'm hoping I can just sneak by here. Um, and get Nancy some, some medical attention. Take care of that guy so he doesn't call any more buddies. And then do this oak, but... Like I said... This this game legitimately has the fear of like just random encounters ingrained into me now. Um, I've been trying to be super careful, but like this right here, 203. Let's see what happens. It only dealt. I was at 170. It dealt 32 instead of 200 damage. I don't understand. It's got to be reflecting on guts somehow, some some way that has to be involved. I think, but sometimes it. Kills me outright. Mrs. Home. <laughs> like, Mrs. Home isn't like that, or Mrs. Home, like, I don't know. That was funny. But now I'm rolling around with Nancy's ghost. Nancy doesn't get any XP from having her ghost be around. Ugh. Skip sandwich lasts so short. Hmm. Bummer. Hmm. I thought that. <sighs> Do I want to talk to this guy if Nancy's a ghost? I guess. Blue, blue. Oops, I won't say that again. I fixed the bridge as a sign of apology. I'm just trying to help. Blue, blue. Maybe they're not singing it. Maybe it's blue, blue. That would make more sense. Kind of like a cultic chant. Blue, 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 blue. But never again with the blue. Cold rain supreme. All right. Let's just try to make it home safely. I think we should be fine. What? He didn't get the jump. I think it's just a little guy. One damage here and there. Yeah, we'll get Nancy fighting fit and then go see everybody that wants to see her because nobody wants to see her corpse. It's a little it's a little morbid. I don't have any mushrooms on my head to give to them. I think this is a straight shot. I don't rightly remember. Let's see. We can just coast through this here. So, hmm, I need to beef Nancy up. Maybe a teddy bear is a good idea for her. 
Uh, maybe that was a clue that I should probably buy, buy a teddy or two and have Nancy carry them. I guess I can go through my old inventory and see if there are things that are worthwhile to bring around now that I have the space for it. I didn't have the space for it before. Some mushrooms. Ah, they're gonna make me do the rest mushroom encounter. Come on! Yeah, one point of damage. Why are they, why are they forcing me to do this? Come on. I shouldn't say that. I should just be appreciative of the fact that they do erase encounters sometimes, which is awesome. Ah, relaxed as this ghost is following me. Alright. I think we can count that as a success to making it to Tucson. Um, do I still have my town map? Do I know where the hospital is? I do. Hospital is all the way up to the north. That is our first stop. Oof. Um, do I have cash? I do. I should have enough. And then I've got to go back to Brooklyn Park, because that's where... I forget his name. It's like Jamie or something. But that's actually completely wrong. But somebody there wants to see Nancy. Made it to the hospital. Could talk to one of the nurses. The doctors are useless. I want Nancy to be seen. Just a hundred bucks? Sure. Sounds good to me. Come back anytime we need. Alright, Nancy is fighting fit. We're in Tucson. I think we are gonna call it for this episode. Uh, this is Marcus with Rough Night Gaming, and we'll see you next time!